that I just said was a waste of time. Oh, man, thanks, Big Tex. I appreciate that. All right. Well, <laughs> I just wasted a whole lot of breath. Um, okay, so here we are. It's been 30 days since I've streamed. Yeah, it was a test. That was just a test. <laughs> I just laid out all the, the uh, game plan here. All right, so it's been 30 days since I've streamed last. The reason for that is because the devs wanted to release an update, a major update, including bosses and some other good stuff, but they didn't want me to stream it. So I went ahead and started a new campaign so that I could kind of try to test out the uh, update before it was released. Now that the update has been released, I can stream it again. I'm at the point where I received a treaty, but the treaty took over 200 in-game days for it to be offered. Let me pause this. I was going to, I explained all this on the overview map, but I'll explain it here even better. All right, so I didn't think I was going to get a treaty offer at that point. After about 30 in-game days, I was like, okay, this just isn't going to happen. This was a wasted campaign. I'm going to delete it and exit out. So I didn't really do prep work. Post-treaty offer, I had 30, I think it was 32 villages. I had each village armed the same. Every village is armed with high quality weapons. No bows, no arrows. They only have one choice of weapon that they can use. Every village is armed the same. Okay, so the first 30 some odd villages I had armed. I went ahead and after I reached 80% of my land back, I went ahead and expanded my village count to 111. All the other 70 odd villages weren't armed. They only had meat and heals, heal items in them. Not thinking that I was gonna, I was going to go ahead and arm them all. But I didn't want to waste my time, so I waited 30 days to see if I could get offered the treaty. I was going to exit out, then arm them, and then when the offer came back, I was going to accept the offer and be ready to go. Well, it took 200 plus days, so at that point I figured it wasn't even going to happen, so I didn't really prep. When I finally got offered the treaty, after waiting 200 days, I didn't want to take a chance on exiting out and seeing if I would be offered it again and have to wait another 100 days or something. So I accepted it. And luckily, I got the treaty that I wanted, which was broken. That, in turn, gave me 4,200 warriors. Every one of my villages are max occupied. Okay, I have 800 plus warriors on patrol. Um, there's a reason for that. I, I guess I could explain everything to you. <laughs> so, prior to a treaty, if you send all your warriors to your core village, you can send them all out on patrol, leaving all of your villages empty. Once you get a treaty, if you get the right treaty, the one that gets broken, all of your villages will be occupied automatically max occupation you also receive 30 sinew bows and medium arrows to arm those bows okay so what i do is fight through my campaign get to 80 percent once i'm at 80 percent i expand my village count and i send every warrior to my core village from my core village i send every warrior out on patrol which is what you see here and one thing i haven't figured out why Although I've sent them from the number one villages, they all seem to have left from village 33. Anyways, what that gives me is 800 plus warriors out on patrol. I get the treaty, they break the treaty, they give me all my new warriors, and then I have like what, 3,200 warriors sitting in villages. So, having accepted the treaty i saw this group of settlers coming at me and i thought this was the only one i sent every warrior from surrounding villages see how it says two one i sent all these warriors to the front here to attack because i wanted to stall them and then i was going to come to this village and come up from behind and just mow the whole thing down well it 
turns out that wasn't correct. I had a whole nother line of dudes coming at me from this direction. I literally have 600 plus settlers coming at me at one time. What they do is every single village you have gets attacked by a group of villagers or a group of settlers, which have between five and seven in each group. So if you do the math, I have 111 villages. I'm going to have 111 groups of settlers coming at me at one time. What these guys are going to do is come down these roads, start spreading out, and head into each one of these villages. Well, the 200 warriors that I sent to the front here got wiped out. They're gone. I already lost them. I mean, you look at it, you figure this is probably 300 or so settlers all armed with regular quality rifles versus 200 warriors coming in piecemeal yeah not a good thing uh what else can i tell you right now i still have all these guys out on patrol i have 800 warriors randomly across the map on patrol and groups of 20 armed all the same so they all have 20 war bows and 200 heavy arrows so what I did is I paused the game, I went into my feeder campaign, I took out all the weapons I could, all the high quality weapons I could, and brought them into this campaign. In order to open each one of those mails, I had to accept the mail, which allowed the game to play through a little bit, which is when I lost all the warriors that I initially sent to attack this crew. So that part of the campaign you're going to miss. But you haven't missed much because these guys haven't moved very far yet. There's a lot to come. So what I did in the meantime, while I had the game paused, was went through all of my new villages and armed them. It took me for frickin' ever. I'm talking like four to five real hours to do this. So I armed every village with the same amount of guns, same type of guns, same amount of ammo, 200 heals, and 200 meat. All right, I've been a busy dude setting this battle up. I've been waiting to do this battle for like a week. So as, as you can see, every one of my villages are armed the same. They don't have any bows. They don't have any choice but to use the good shit. So where we're at right now is once I unpause this, these guys are going to come through and start wiping out some of the villages. I'm going to lose a lot more warriors here. Since I lost 200 warriors already in this group, I don't think I want to go and attack these guys myself because they will have picked up all the high quality weapons that my groups had. If I send my warriors, allow my warriors to attack these guys, my warriors will recollect all those weapons. If I try to attack these guys myself, I might miss some, and if I miss some, I'm going to lose a lot of high-quality weapons. I don't want to do that. So what I'm stuck doing now is basically I have to let this group of guys come through and reach points that I can attack them at with my warriors so that I can collect all my guns back, and I can attack the group up here. Kidok. So what I have on me... Let's see where we're at. I set this up last night, so I kind of forget where I'm at. Um, I'm going to rock an ash bow with some exploding arrows. I'm going full kill mode here. It's nothing about... I have no need to interrogate fools. So I have an ash bow with some heavies. And I've got a whole line of curatives that I'm going to use. I think what I'm going to do is... I might crash the game <laughs> but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come up here I'm gonna try to head off this group of settlers meanwhile these guys will go ahead and spread out and then I'll deal with them after I attack these guys I'm gonna try my best to stop these guys what I should probably do is just let, let these guys come through because they will spread out they will also run into my uh, my patrols and instead of attacking a group of 400 plus warriors or uh, settlers, they will attack villages one at a time, making it a lot easier to kill them. 
And what I also noticed is all of these new villages are fairly well scaled up. I mean, at least they're not level ones. So they should stand a pretty good chance. Yeah. There we go. I kind of want to get a really epic battle on a stream. So I think this is my best chance of doing that. So yeah. I believe... Oh, wait, wait. No. I have one other thing I did. I, I canceled a bunch of patrols. I got to see where they end up going. I don't know if they're going to go to my core village, which only has three dudes in it right now. Very dangerous situation. Or if they're going to go to this 33. I, I suspect they're going to go to 33. Because that's pretty much what it says. See, all these patrols here have already seen some action. See, this one's canceled. So they have loot. The reason I send all my warriors to one village and then send them out from that village to patrol is when I cancel the patrol after they see action, they're going to take all that loot to one village. They're not going to spread it around the map. And usually I like to do that to my core village so that all the loot goes directly back to my core village. I also make sure that I have enough meat in that core village so that whoever returns and overpopulates that village won't leave because I have the meat to cover them. So I have 20,000 meat in my number one village and I have, uh, I put 10,000 meat in this 33 village. I suspect they're going to come to this 33, which is not ideal, but is good enough, I suppose. I really don't like the fact that I only have um, three warriors in my core village. So this one says it's 20 from number one. So I'm going to go ahead and cancel them as well. But let's go ahead and get into the action here. That was a lot of work to set this up. This better go good. <laughs> Alright, so here's our movement. As you can see, they're spreading out. That's a lot of dudes right there. Let me get a close-up in there. Do you see all those groups? Is that not insane? And they're going to go ahead and pile on through that first village. That's not going to be good. That is not going to be pretty. What do we got up here? A little bit less. I'd say probably a third of them are up here and two thirds are down at the bottom. So I'm thinking in my head what I want to do is come to this village so I can head these guys off and see how much damage my war party can do. You should see how many arrows. Um, I can't really show you my warriors without taking a lot of time here, can I? This is a perfect bottleneck. But I kind of suspect if I come to this village, for whatever reason, the AI is a little too smart, and they're going to start spreading out, going up above me. But we're going to find out. My warriors, I've been collecting um, arrows and heal healing potions pretty much since the get-go. So they all carry 600 arrows. They have more than enough to do this damage. And I think that's just what we're going to do. I'm kind of thinking here. But, yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to come here. <coughs> this should be interesting, to say the least. Uh, let's see. Well, at least you guys didn't have to sit through the loading screen from the overview map. <laughs> oh, wait, yeah, you did. Huh. Amber, what's happening? All right, all right, all right. This is where it begins. Um, I want to go with, like, and check out my warriors here real quick. 688 arrows. 600 arrows, 500 arrows, 6. So, yeah, my boys are good to go. I want them to mirror me. They're all on open fire. And shit's about to get real. Where are we? Where's the first ones? I'm probably going to crash this game. More than likely. Yeah, see? Damn it. Hold on. Pause. 
They already got ahead of me. Uh, and it is 33 that's going to get overpopulated. They already have 130 warriors sitting in there. Hmm. So, I can... I'm going to send a patrol, a large-ass patrol, to 43 and 108... I'm going to try to get these guys, let's send, uh, let's send 40 at a time, how about that, I want you to go from 1 to 43, no, I probably should go from 33 to 43 then, since that seems, yeah, alright, I want you to go to 43, I think this is going to work. Um, I don't have enough war bows in here, do I? Huh. So, 40. I need to give you about 200. And 80. 33 to 43, okay. And the other one I said was what? What is that? 108 to 108. Send a patrol of 40 warriors. We're going to go from 33 to 108. So 33. 108. We'll go with 40. Whoops. We'll go with 200. We'll go with 80. Alright. That's going to put me at 50 more. So, we are going to send a patrol to come kick some but down this way, and we're going to send them straight to 83. Another 40. We'll go from 33 to 80. Is that right? Was that 80 I said? 83. Glad I left. Thirty-three to eighty-three, and ch -ch -ch -ch. nobody said this was going to be easy. <laughs> uh, let's go forty. Another two hundred. I really should arm these guys with high quality weapons, but I don't want to go through all that. I've already done enough prep work here. Um, what am I doing? 80. And boom. Okay. Now, I do need to get some more of these bad boys in here. This is a really easy way to transfer weapons, by the way. What's that give me? 261? Well, it's... I guess that's pretty good. Huh, I'm really long. Wait, no. There it is. I got one more. Put those there. Now I need heavies. Uh, let's take 20,000, then bad boys, just because we can. Alright, because I'm expecting more warriors to come to this village. So, one is still not good, okay. Alright, what do I want to do here? I did not get in front of them like I wanted, 
So I wonder if I can get over to this one. I think I can. Oh, what are we saying? The amount of warriors is dry. Nice. Yeah. Well, well, we'll see. I. Oh shit. Uh oh. I got the blue circle of death going. Ah, I think I might have just crashed it. Uh, it's not looking good, guys. I think once I get down to the actual warrior fight, like on the ground, it's going to go super slow <laughs> frames per second. Yeah, she crashed. All right, let's try that again. Yeah, I'm going to crash this game a few times, guys. This I don't think this game is really designed for what I'm doing to it. <laughs> Which has always been my goal. I mean, that's a badge of honor right there for me. But you're going to have to bear with me for a second. I'm restarting. Hopefully. <laughs> there we go. And we're going to have to give this another go. Yeah, I got jinxed big time. <laughs> oh, that crashed a lot sooner than I thought it would. Which is one reason I was kind of hesitant on actually streaming this, because I know this isn't going to be pretty. But at the same point, you know, the devs want, they can watch this and hopefully figure things out, because people should be able to do this. I mean, I think I could actually get more going than this. Um, I have another, my other campaign is almost to the point of the treaty. And now that I've reached 4,200 warriors, I plan on trying to shoot for 5,000 warriors. So, I mean, this isn't going to be the biggest battle I've ever fought or I will ever fight. It's just the biggest battle I've ever fought so far. Hopefully, yeah, okay, good. My mic's still working. <laughs> Oh, man. All right. Hopefully we're loading up here. And it'll save me at my last point of fast travel. So hopefully all those patrols I just sent out will still be headed out. We're going to have to see where it saved me at. As long as the file doesn't get corrupted, I don't mind having to jump back in a little bit. Okay, good. Where are we at? Tell me... Ah, uh, shoot. Are you kidding me? Fudge. Okay, I gotta send the patrols back out. Yeah, I didn't even make it up, so it saved from that point. Alright, well, I know I need to go to 43 instead, so... The day in the life of the dog. I gotta send these patrols back out. Shoot. Okay. Anyways, gotta do what you gotta do. So I'm gonna send a patrol to 43 and 108. From 33. To 43. Where, uh, of course, where the heck is 43? There it is. Um, ch -ch 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 -ch. Let's see if I can do this quickly. I want to give you 80, and I need 200 heavies. Alright, 4280. 33 to 43. Let's just go ahead and transfer my. No. Some more war bows over. Get you. 
Go to one more and put you. Get some more heavy arrows. Twenty thousand. Put you bad boys there. This is sad. Huh. Um. Psh, psh, psh. Okay. So, where am I at? One oh eight. Send a patrol to one oh eight. Thirty-three complicates things too when you have over a hundred villages. <laughs> yes. Okay. We'll get to forty and two hundred. So I'm guessing I need to cancel that one patrol that's actually coming from my core village so I can get some dudes in that village. Not that I expect uh, these guys to actually make it that far. Considering all of the patrols I have out. Where is this guy? Okay, so he's still canceled. So I got 20 more warriors going to my core, which has all my loot. I need to send you to where? 63 is going to get hit hard. But if I send them to 6... Oh, no. What do I want to send these guys? By the time they reach there, this whole path of guys are going to be past it. Hmm. Um... I know they're going to come down this road. So I think I want to send a patrol from 68 to 31. Okay, let's do that. Let's send a patrol from 68 to 31. And nothing says the patrol has to leave to, what did I say, 31? To 31. You can set patrols to not patrol the village that they initially leave from. So instead of having to do 33 to whatever, I can do whatever two villages I want. So I'm going to send these guys on a short patrol. Um, shit, you only have 29. That's good enough. I must have more dudes coming. Um... 29, it's about 150, that's fine. And we'll go with about 60. All right, so 29, 150, eh, I could give you 200, what do I care? It's not like I don't have enough arrows. <laughs> All right, that should work out pretty good. All right, are we ready? I think I'm going to try to save this time, so I don't have to do that for the third time. Where are we at? Alright. Alright, let's give this another shot. Let's save. And then we're going to fast travel. Do you have a camp named Two Dogs in the Mud? <laughs> now, actually, I have my core village I renamed, which I don't usually do, 63 is in battle, is uh, the Doggy Pound. The Doggy Pound. <laughs> Look, I'll show you a little bit of the loot I've gathered. Everything that's not high quality is stuff that I've gained off this campaign. 173, 500. Look at the... Wait, I'm going to show off a little bit. Look at the gun parts. And I've already crafted a bunch of guns. But I've gained a ton of gun parts from this campaign. I take it. I like it. I already beat all the bosses. I'm going to have to do... Uh, I have all the bosses still available on the other campaign that I'll start streaming after this. So I'll be able to show the, do the uh, boss fights. Okay, like I said, I can't 
really attack any of these guys on my own because they're carrying a bunch of weapons from dudes I already lost to them. So I'm going to shoot for these guys and I'm going to actually go straight to this village instead. So let's get it on. Alright, All right. looks like we're going to make it to the village. That's good. Yeah, I don't know if this is going to work or not. Alright, we got somebody in there. I want to make sure I had you fools off. Let's go ahead and get on mirror me. Where is this? I gotta go that way. Alright, 83 is going for it. I just need to find the tip of these guys. Come on. I beat them to the crossroad. That's good. I should be coming up on these guys. I should be in the middle of them. Oh yeah. I got a feeling I'm going to have a bunch of dudes popping up around me. Okay. Let the lag begin. I want to make sure everybody's on open fire. I see a few dudes. There we go. And what am I holding? I want to hold... Uh, I'll start with an ash bow. Or... Alright, whatever. You know what? Screw it. I'm going to go with... Not get in killed. And we're going to go with that. We're going to go with that. We are going to switch. And go big on these bitches. Ah, come on. I got somebody's attention. Whoa! <laughs> I like it. Look at that dude. Boom, bitch. You gonna die, son. Yeah, this isn't going to go very well for me. I can already see that. Okay, I just don't see these guys though. Whoa. Okay, I gotta get out of here. Yeah, this is a mistake. <laughs> I am watching my health bar for sure. Damn, boy. Another little trick is if you keep moving sideways, they have a hard time hitting you. There's no way I'm ever going to find all these. got to be up there somewhere. I'm just shooting where I think they're going to be. Or where I think they are. Kind of looks like their numbers are dwindling. A little bit. And hoping that my warriors are doing okay. And they are not. Let's get you healed up. Let's get you healed up. Come on, boys. I gotta get myself healed up. Okay. Where are all these guys? I'm 
looking for large groups. I'm running out of arrows. I keep saying like I have mass groups somewhere. Oh shit. Stop it. Shit, 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 shit. Come on. Whoa. Thank you, guys. Appreciate your help. Oh, 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 you're getting too close. Who's up? Who's up? What she got? I only see one dude here. Okay. Alright. What do we got? Are we done? Interesting. Um, that's interesting. Alright, what do we got? What happened? Took out a couple of groups. Still got a large core there. We got a lot more behind us. Thing is, I really want to gather all the damn loot. <laughs> Let's go this way. See what we can do. I have no idea how many dudes I just killed. I need to heal up more. Actually, I should go back to the uh, village so I can grab some more stuff to heal with. Where are you? You're up there. Come on. Oh, perfect. Nice shot. There you go. Okay, I'm back. I don't know how long I lost the mic for, but sorry about that. Hey, hey. What a mess I got myself into here. Alright, so we're paused. What's 33 looking like? 33's only got 21 dudes, okay. 
Uh, what's going on? What's oh damn! Look at all those guys. Ah, <laughs> but I'll do okay if they attack each village with just one group. I'll be fine. These villages will be able to stand up to them. What I was saying, I don't know if anybody heard, but what would be smart of me to do is to actually not fight these fights myself. I should just let them go to the villages and let the villages do the fighting for me so I don't lose all this loot. These guys have already passed me up and it looks like there's only four more groups headed my way. I was going to head to a village and get some more stuff to heal but I think I think what I should do is probably take out these four groups and then just stay over here and collect this loot while the rest of the thing plays out. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's... I got my little fix of a big battle. I don't know how many groups I've taken out so far. It's got to be more than three. Um... Okay. So I've got 23 exploding arrows left. I'm just wasted one. No, that hit him. Alright, I like it. Let's see if I can get these guys. But boy. Oh, there's a nice group. Hey, guys. That's right, shoot at me, bitch. That's what you get. That's what you get for coming to a gunfight. Or a uh, explosive arrow fight with guns. <laughs> you get work, son. Alright, so these dudes, these four groups are behind me. Yeah, thanks for the help there, guys. Alright. Kill that guy for me, would you? Thank you, thank you. Go ahead and finish him off. Did you guys get him? Yeah, good. Oh, it's moving super laggy. Alright, where am I at? <laughs> I'm in the middle of them. Alright, good. So those guys are done. I just need to come up here and head these fools off. I've only got 20 arrows left and I only have a few medicines. But, I believe, what you're actually looking at, yeah, see my health is at 5,000. So that's why it looks like I only have half health. But at half health, I would have 2,500, so I'm actually doing okay. Alright, we're going to have a lot of dudes dying. <laughs> Alright, let's finish these guys off. Uh, let's go ahead and switch over. Until I find some larger groups. That's right. Come straight to me. What I wish I had was some uh, big spike traps. That would be real useful right now. I told you to die, son. Good boy. Headshots all day long. That's what we're looking for. Come to me. Oh, that's a good shot. Right in the kidney. That's going to hurt. You're not going to pee right for a week. Come on. The game is moving so slow, dude. It's not even funny. With the low FPS and my concentration, yeah, I've got plenty of time to think.
Oh. That was way over his head. I've noticed too, with the update, if you just spam hit the fire, you don't get any accuracy at all. So you actually have to take a second and aim. Come on. Yeah, see what I mean? These arrows are just going everywhere. I need to slow my roll. Which apparently I'm not doing. Okay, it sounds like my boy's finally caught up with me. And let's go ahead and switch back to Ash. Walk the line, son. Walk the line. I see my dudes are killing a lot of guys. I like it. I'm not seeing a whole line of my dudes dying, so that's a good sign. Oh, that was a dead. Uh, speak of the devil. There goes a bunch of my dudes dying. How am I not hitting these guys? Boom, bitch, die. There it goes. Okay, now I can switch back. <sighs> Ready? I think we're almost done with these groups. He gone. You about to die. Oh, thanks guys. I appreciate the help. I can always count on my boys to back me up. Oh, and all the uh, dudes on patrol are maxed out because they came from my villages that I had been skilling up throughout the campaign. Where is this guy? Alright, looks like the action's about to slow down here. Where are you? Oh, where the hell are you? I don't see him. I can hear my warriors fighting the battle at the village. Okay, whatever. I don't want to get too close to that village. I want the villagers to collect the weapons. Looks like we're going to come back this way. Have I lost? Looks like I've lost one warrior from my war party. Get this guy. These guys are all popping up out of nowhere. Okay, I took out another group. Boom. Yeah, my war party dudes are pissed. They don't like being shot. <laughs> uh, let's heal you up. Heal you up. What you got? What you got? You're doing okay. You're doing okay. Not too bad. Alright, I like it, I like it. We got anybody left over here? That's gone. These guys need to work their own shit. Alright, let's see what we got going on the map. <sighs> There's a lot to think about here. So I still got this. Eh. That's crazy. What's 33 looking like? 21? Is that 21? Yeah. Okay.
Man. See how they're all spreading out to go to their own individual villages? That's really what I should have just let them do. I stand a lot better chance of minimizing my losses that way. This whole group. It's when this whole group decides to pass through a village to get to the road that I get in trouble. Alright. He's still fighting. Okay, I think at this point... I can pretty much just let it play through. I just need to find... There's no way I'm going to collect all that loot from the dudes I've killed so far. I'd be ashamed to lose it all, though. Right, I think we're pretty safe up here. Let's just kind of watch this play through. I could come and help this village out. See, I'm just afraid if I go over to this village, I'm going to lose all this loot. I think things are pretty much out of my control, out of my hands at this point. Good luck, boys. Damn, look at all that. That's some fighting right there. <laughs> That is a fight. <coughs> down to 21, down to 20. I can hear some shooting around me. I don't think I'm getting hit though. Look at all those guys dying. Uh, that's a lot of dead dudes. Look at my SP going up too, though. Woohoo, doggy! You're gonna die. Oh, down to four, two, one. Oh, let me grab the guns, you bitch. <laughs> you gone. There was no way that village was gonna make it. There was just no way. Ah, oh, that's harsh. All right. Damn, son. Looks like my patrols are finally running into dudes. That should thin the herds a little bit. This top section looks a lot better off than this bottom section. Look at these guys spread out. Stop massing up on villages. I need you guys to spread out out spread out yeah <laughs> it it is the optimization is working pretty well though i mean i was expecting it to crash when i ran into the five or seven groups whatever i just hit how many did i take out anyways what did i take out three Four, five, six. So about six groups I took out. Right, where are we at? So looks like about five groups are coming at this one village. Now remember, all these villages have high-quality weapons, so they're going to do pretty well. But there's only so much a village can handle. This guy's gone. He's done. Ah, it's a lot of dudes dying. Here goes another group. Another big fight happening. We're pretty much just sitting here watching this shit go down. Really, nothing much I can do. 
Ah, my patrols are getting worked pretty good. Where's he at? Oh, he's still fighting. Damn. Losing a lot of warriors. I've never actually fought a battle on this proportion, so... I was hoping I could head off the whole set of guys and just take out like 300 dudes in one shot, but it doesn't look like that's even possible. They just go around you. I'm sure the game doesn't want to try to spawn in... Doesn't want to spawn in 600 settlers, because that would definitely crash. There goes another village. That's harsh. Now I'm not too worried about the loot in these villages because from what I've seen from other campaigns I'll lose the loot in this village but these guys will pick that loot up and if they die at another village that village will get the loot so I shouldn't be actually losing any uh, high quality weapons as long as I don't take out any of the guys that are holding them myself and lose it, you know, not gather it. Okay, so things are pretty much one on one up here, which is just what I wanted. Except this is two on one, and that's like three on one. Alright, um. I guess I could go help these guys out. There's no way I'm ever going to gather all the loot from the dudes I've already killed, so I'll just call that a loss. I am headed the right way, right? I am. Okay. I'm going to go help this village out. One of the problems with running into a village that's under attack is the settlers will... See, that's probably what's going to happen here. I'm probably going to lose this village. The frickin' settlers will spawn in before your warriors. And when your warriors finally spawn in, they just get wiped out. Shit, there's a shit ton more guys here than I thought. Which is probably what's happening right now. Yeah, okay, that's the last time you're gonna do that. Dick. Come on, guys, don't just stand around like dipshits. Get your guns and start the fight. Be a little bit aggressive, no? Just a little bit? There you go. Throw a frickin' punch, would ya? Grab a gun, dummy. Uh, these guys aren't even grabbing guns. Now see, if I fast travel into this camp, it'd be another story. My warriors would spawn in first, have their guns, and be ready to go. They would just wipe all these idiots out. But when I run into it, it's the other way around. Okay, and I'm out of stamina. Where are we at? Who, what? Pop them in the head, dude. Okay, we got anybody left? Good. One more. Where is this guy? Somewhere over here. Where you at, bitch? What? What? That's right. You gone. You be gone, son. Alright. I believe... Boom, we are safe. I kind of wonder... Um, that's is stupid to try to collect this loot. I should just focus on the fight. I love loot, though. It's not really like I need it. 
Yeah, see, you didn't even have a weapon on him. I gotta gather a little bit of loot. Come on. Really? There we go. I wonder if I could fast travel to one of the villages that have a large group attacking them. Alright, let's pause the game for a second. Let's go with... Drop that. Uh, get rid of all of that. Get rid of that. That. So, I want... I want Ginkgo. I want 50 of you. Close this. Some medicine. I want about 50 of you. Explosive arrows. Uh, let's take about 40 of you. Am I still holding something that's putting me overweight? 184 to... no. Alright. We're going to come here. We're going to get some more stuff to heal with. Take a couple of you. Take a few of you. Where's that prickly pear? That is good stuff. And you. Okay. We're going to go with two. We're just going to get a whole bunch of shit going here. There we go. We're back to having explosive arrows. Alright, let's pause. Let's see where we're at. Nope. Not what I want. Now. You have separated. See, I wish I could have gone to this. I should have done that. I should have fast traveled there. What are you fighting? Is that a patrol, I guess? That is a patrol. Alright, so what I need is for this large group to come by a village. And I can fast travel to there. Oh, wait, no, I can't. Yeah, alright. Because I don't want to lose all that loot. So, let's just let it play through. I think the worst of it's over. As long as these guys spread out. The worst of it will be over. They don't stand a chance. One settler group against one of my villages does not stand a chance. Or I could come down here and help. But I'm not. I'm going to stop thinking about it so much. At the end of the day, I want to come back down this line and collect all that loot. Okay. You're doing all right. Where are you guys going? And you're doing some damage. You need to kiss my ass. Right, I need to pause. Um, equip. See if we can't send these guys out to help. We'll start doing some pushback here. What do we got? 60. Alright. Looks like he's safe. So there's three. I think I need to hit him. And... I'm going to send another one. So I hit him, I hit him, I need to hit him. Alright, that should work. Okay, he's doing alright. 
doesn't look like anybody's going to come here. So we will... We will go and help him. We'll go with 60. You, or even better, you can go and help him. Alright. I should help with that. Okay. What about these guys? What's going on over here? Where are you headed? You're headed up the road for some reason. Let's go ahead and pick you off. Ooh, 85's gone. That sucks. Um, man, there's just so much going on. It's crazy. Looks like 20... Oh, yeah, let's see. They, they won their battle. Now they can feel free to help. And we're going to go with... Where's my... Where are my heels? I don't know. Just send you with something. Okay. I want these guys to play through a little bit. And let's just see what that does for us. Oh yeah, gringo juice, yeah. The ginkgo juice, yep. That's good stuff, but it's super expensive. <laughs> and it's limited supply. Looks like that's good, okay. So, I'm not seeing much left up on top. That's good. We're about to take care of the situation down here. These guys are coming in to attack. Um, looks like this guy could come and do some damage. Let's send you over here. We'll go with 60. And we're going to send you over to help. And what else? He's already got dudes on him. I'm just waiting for these guys to separate a little bit. Hmm. Thing is, I don't know where these guys are going. So... Let's see how that goes. I already sent somebody over here. Alright. I want to go attack. I want to get these guys. And I'll give you the grocery. These guys look like they're having kind of a hard time. I need somebody to attack this front guy. Oh, those guys are close. Okay. Looks like, uh... These villages are not going to get attacked. So, 
so I can pick these guys off. Damn, they use a lot of stuff. Oh, look at the grocery though. I like it. That'll skill them up. What about you? Can you do anything for me? You can. You can help out here. Alright. You're looking good. Looks like they're not going to come to this village, so I can have them attack. This is how I push back. You come at me, I'm going to come at you. You can kiss my ass. Go get you, I'm going to go get you. Got a little, little of that action. Looks like I can have you help. And I'm trying to keep track of which group I'm attacking. I don't want four sets of patrols attacking one group. I want them all spread out. Looks like I used all my healing and stuff though. That sucks. Let's give you whatever I got. Hope for the best. Uh, you need to come and head these guys off a little bit. Okay. Looks like you can come up here. Help out. Alright. <laughs> Let's see how that does. What's that? Uh, what do I know? How to message you? There you go. What does the feathers or white stripe indicate on the... Mm. Not sure what you're what you're referring to on the camp list. I don't know. I'm not sure, my friend. All right, what do we got going on down here? So we got a large group coming in here. They're getting swarmed. I've got a few more guys headed over there. Shit, he's coming to that village. You bastard. I sent the group out from that village. That's not good. And we'll go 60. And send you after them. Shoot, that village is going to get wiped. Well, I'm going to take all this stuff out first. <laughs> Sucker. You can't have my shit. I take all this shit out before it gets wiped out. <laughs> uh, all right. I've got way too much going on here. I need to get rid of all that. I'm still seeing a lot of dudes dying. So much for having 4,000 warriors. That is not a thing anymore. Oh. Alright, where are we at? Where are we at? Okay. Let's pause this. It looks like they're all grouping up on this guy. 